The temperature dropped down at the point in record history due to global warming. That is changing weather patterns and disturbing the usual balance of nature. However, some nature will not change. For example, birds are still flying around to get their food, and boba still chirping along with birds. So cute. Today, I'm going to paint varied tit eating berries in the cold winter. In my previous video, I mentioned that I would like to challenge myself to paint a variety of subjects this year. In this painting, I'm going to see if I can recreate the moment of this varied tit eating berries caught by a photographer. I originally found this image on Pinterest, but there is no information about this photo. Then I did more research, the results are confusing. There are so many different resources for this image. I only listed two main resources that I found here. When I sketched this painting, I found out the most difficult part is how to draw the proportion of this bird correctly. It took me longer to complete this sketch. What is the most difficult part of your painting? The wing in the back was moving and not focused, so I'm going to paint in while creating bouquet effect background. This way, the viewers can focus on the main body of this bird and berries. Now let's define the wing a little bit more since the paper is still damp. Also, we can use lifting color technique to create some highlight of the wind. I decided to add snow on the berries to bring the winter atmosphere. Also, I created a bokeh effect background and the berry branches with berries as middle ground to add the illusion of space to this painting. We always stay in our comfort zone towards living 
situation, friends, jobs, and even ourselves, because it's safe and familiar. Lately, I'm so eager to change myself to be a happier and better person. In the process, it's so hard. The first thing that I notice is that it's difficult to get out of my comfort zone. Sometimes these comfort zones don't fit me anymore, or even become toxic. But I still cannot leave. Stepping outside of it can take not only my courage, but also have to face uncertainty. Fear, risk, and potential failure. I admit that I feel anxious while analyzing my own issues. I feel comfortable painting Bokan in a background so far. But have some concerns of how to create the texture of bird's feather. In this painting, I decided to create the value and the form of this bird by applying tiny brush strokes one by one. As you can see, it takes forever. However, I enjoy the slow process and see how the body has formed. The whole process took me more than a few hours, so it's impossible to have all clips in my video. That's why I had to speed these clips up to three to three point five times faster than real time, in order to show you part of the process. I actually feel stressed by not including. All the clips that I have. After taking a break, I realized that it's the time to step outside of my comfort zone to let things go, which is to only show you the clips of painting birds. I always want to include everything to please everyone. However, it actually burdens me so much and fails to look after. What the most important and essential parts of each event are? Did this happen to you as well?
I want to make sure that everyone is happy around me. But in fact, is it possible? The answer is no. Why not? It's actually against the balance of nature. How? We can never read others' mind and even change ourselves to fit in with others. It might work for a short period of time, but for the longer term, you will lose yourself. Don't forget to stay the course and never lose your initial dream. I am inspired by this photo because of not only the movement of this bird, but also how its wings spread wide open in order to keep its balance and stay in the same location. This bird is determined to reach these berries and eat them. For me, in order to reach my goals, can I be this brave and just spray my wings and soar to gray heights? Can you? Although this painting took me longer to complete, I'm actually happy with the final result. What do you think? Thank you so much for being here to watch me paint and uh, listen to my story. I hope that you can get some inspiration from this video. By the way, I really appreciate your comments. I'm still running and making improvements to my channels. Please feel free to leave me a comment. Also, if you like today's video, please draw me a like, recommend to your friends, subscribe, and turn on notifications. Until next time, happy painting!